I'm addicted to nicotine, yeah. but uh, <laughs> I, I could tell, but yeah. if I wanted to quit vaping, I guess I could, but I, I really don't want to give up. No? Like, yeah, why, why not? <laughs> I mean, there's, there's no reason to give up, though. Vaping is dangerous because it's the same as smoking in that there's nicotine in most, uh, if not all, of the vape products, but it gives you the perception, because it's not cigarettes, that it might be a little bit safer. I'm Willie Eggleston. I'm a toxicologist at the Upstate New York Poison Center. One jewel pod's about one pack of cigarettes. We really need to get the message out to our kids that these are not safe products. In Health Watch, the Food and Drug Administration is investigating a potential link between seizures and the use of e-cigarettes. According to the FDA, users in some of those cases also reported experiencing fainting or tremors. A new study coming out of Yale University, it finds that people who use some e-cigarettes are consuming more than the ingredients that are listed on that package. Like, do you aware that there are dangerous chemicals in it? Yeah. I mean, I do, I do, but the actual component of the juice that we are vaping is, is PG and VG and nicotine. So... Actually, if you if you think about the ingredients, like the safety of the ingredients, it's it's really not that dangerous, I think. It tastes tastes better. One in five high school students now reports vaping, and one in twenty middle school students is reported vaping. There's harmful chemicals, there's nicotine, they're addictive, and they can impact brain development. The new Juul devices and other similar products look like USB sticks, so the kind of thing you would stick into your computer to save a paper or save a file on, but these small USB shaped ones are pretty small and easy to hide. Vaping can deliver nicotine to your brain, reprogramming you to crave more and more. Don't get hacked. Is it expensive? Uh, not really. Five uh, bucks. It's a lot healthier than just smoking cigarettes. The reality is, is they can be just as dangerous. In addition to the harmful chemicals that are in the vaping product, there are also tiny particles, and those tiny particles can lodge themselves in your lungs. And when they do that, uh, over time, they may cause damage. We still don't know because they are such new products. Some people think that vaping is no big deal, but that is just an illusion. Do you vape? Yeah. You do? Do you have a vape with you today? Yeah. I see. Oh, okay, cool. I want to hold your hand up for me. I'm going to take the vape like this. I'm going to put it into your hand like that. Okay, this is what I'm going to do, okay? Okay, here we go. Watch very carefully. Boom. <laughs> Did you know that if you vape, you're more likely to start smoking cigarettes? It's not magic, it's statistics. Yeah, I don't want to do that. And so at the end of the day, is vaping safe? Only for someone who's currently smoking. If you're not currently smoking, vaping is not a safe thing to start. I really don't want them to smoke at all, like start smoking at all.